Hi, I'm Hope Warshaw, a dietitian and diabetes educator for more than 30 years. I'm the author of a few best-selling books from the American Diabetes Association, and I'm always pleased to support ADA's efforts to make taking care of diabetes just a bit easier. Have you been encouraged to carb count, but don't quite know how to jump in? Do you face plates of food and find it difficult to estimate the carbohydrate grams? Are you a restaurant meal eater and need tips to right size your portions? If you answered yes, I can help. I'll share tips from Complete Guide to Carb Counting written with my colleague Carmeen Kilkarni. To accurately estimate the carb counts of foods, it's important to get familiar with how these foods look on your plates, in your bowls, or your glasses. To do this, it's important to have and use, yes, using them is the important part, a few measuring tools. Measuring cups and spoons and a food scale. Once you become familiar with how the portions of foods you should eat look in your serving dishes, you can use your measuring equipment less often. But do leave them on the counter as a reminder to use them. On occasion, check your estimating abilities. Consider making Mondays the start of each week your measure days. Put an estimated serving of the food you are about to eat in your plate or bowl. Then measure the portion using your measuring equipment. Is it the right size? Serve on smaller plates and bowls. Less food looks like more food on smaller plates. Plus, you'll avoid the temptation to overeat. When you buy fresh produce from fruits to vegetables and starches like potatoes and corn, buy the smallest pieces or buy a larger piece and plan on eating just half. Eating right-sized portions of restaurant foods is challenging. There's a whole chapter on this topic in Complete Guide to Carb Counting. Bottom line, the more you weigh and measure your foods on the home front, and carefully read the carbohydrate count on the Nutrition Facts label, the more you'll train your eyes to precisely estimate servings and carbohydrate counts in restaurant foods. Along with your eyes, remember you've got your hands. Put these handy hand guides into action. For starters, think about your thumb. From the tip of your finger to your second knuckle, equals about one tablespoon. Think about one tablespoon of salad dressing. The palm of your hand is about three ounces. Think about three ounces of cooked meat, such as a hamburger or a chicken breast. A tight fist equals about one half cup. Think about one serving of canned applesauce. To gather more skills and strategies for restaurant eating, from fast food to sit down restaurants, Check out another one of my ADA books, Guide to Healthy Restaurant Eating. Both books, The Complete Guide to Carb Counting and The Guide to Healthy Restaurant Eating, will give you the assistance you need to control your weight and diabetes to stay healthy over the years. Thanks for watching and please take good care of your diabetes.